Sundance has officially ended, and that means I can finally start covering so many amazing films on here. And the first one we'll be covering, well, it actually comes out this Friday. So let's talk about it. What's going on, everybody? Welcome back to a brand new movie review. Today, I'm going to be discussing Land. This is actually the directorial debut of Robin Wright, and it actually stars her as well. It's about a bereaved woman who seeks out a new life off the grid in Wyoming. Now, this is a movie I didn't know what to expect from because, you know, when you get a directorial debut, sometimes it's awesome and sometimes it's not. But in this case, it's great. And I think Robin Wright does such a great job here in so many different ways. Of course, if you guys are new here though, and you guys love talking movies just as much as I do, or you guys are just a geek like me, hit that like and subscribe button so you don't miss out on content like this over here on a daily basis. I'm energetic, I love being a geek, and I love talking movies, and if you do too, this is the channel for you guys. Let's also talk about it down below in the comment section as well. Straight off the bat, my favorite thing about this film was the way that it dealt with the look and, of course, the message about loss grieving and suicide and even depression because in a sense land yes it's her going out to wyoming getting this cabin that very much is very run down and she needs to build back up but in general the environment which is absolutely stunning like filmed in such an immaculate way it really makes you feel like you are there in the wilderness with her but overall this is more than just your typical story of a girl going off the grid and really much having to come to herself in one because again she's dealing with a grieving She's lost a lot of people in her lives, and now she kind of just, in a sense, is depressed. And for me, the thing that, again, I loved about this is how this is more of a survival story, but not just physically, but mentally as well. And I don't think we get a lot of films like that where it deals with both outcomes and in general how both of those elements could truly work. You know, even if this film had taken place not in the wilderness, I still think Robin Wright would have framed that as this direction and I think it was brilliant to see how she was able to bring that about in her directorial debut. Her performance as well in here is great. I mean, she is also one of the greatest actresses ever to live, but she is performing at her highest outcome and I loved it. Even Demian Bashir, who plays an excellent supporting role in every single thing he shows up in, he is great in here as well, especially with his chemistry and of course every interaction that he gets with Robin Wright's character is just superb. Even when I walked out of land, I found this to be a very simplistic film, but one that had a deeper meaning and different layers of it. You know, good score, great cinematography, great acting, and a great message all formulates this movie to again be really good. Even its runtime is perfectly paced to where it needs to go. I was absolutely really shocked with this. I was going into this expecting it to maybe even be boring, but in fact, I came out with a newfound appreciation for a new message, a theme, and a way of dealing with grieving and loss. And again, this story of survival very much attached me to it all. So with all that said, I'm going to give Land a B+. Plus. I think some people might find this film to be a little bit boring depending on who you are, but really much this is a film that I think is actually quite surprising, especially as a directorial debut. Again, it's simple, but it very much grabbed me with its message. Thank you guys again for clicking on this go. You guys are seriously all the best. If you guys are new here, head on over to Samtron Films on how to see films early. And of course, it's a big thing to you and a big thing to my Patreon supporters, because without you, I wouldn't be able to do this. Thank you guys again, and of course, until next time, stay classy.